guys, this is Nash and today I'm going to review Resurrection Remix Treble Room for my Redmi Note 4. As you already know, Project Treble was invented so all the Android devices get updates easily. It's based on latest Android 8.1, so let's get started. So guys, installing Treble ROM is little bit different than installing a normal custom ROM. In most cases, you have to use different kind of recovery. Well, for me, I use my normal TWRP recovery and it's working fine. And gaps means Google Apps are optional. And if you want to see separate video for that, let me know in the comment section. I will make a separate video that how to install a Treble custom ROM. So this ROM is not pre-rooted, so you will have to root yourself if you want to use root apps. And this room has OTA updates, so it's very easy for you to update the room. And as far as features and customization is concerned, well, Resurrection Remix is the only room that has the most amount of features and customization. In this room, you get status bar customization, custom header, app circle bar, pie mode. Power menu customization, navigation bar customization, lock screen customization, animation customization, and other hundreds and hundreds of features. If you flash this room, you will definitely spend your whole night customizing your phone because there is so much to do in this room. And along with that, you get smart pixels feature that will save your battery life and will give you long battery life. And how can I forget one of the coolest feature, the fling bar. And guys, just have a look at this gorgeous notification drawer. It has one tab Google Assistant, live display, screen record. You can search any song from here and you can directly go to Resurrection Remix features. And just look at this boot animation. It's by far one of the most unique boot animation that I have ever seen. So that was all good things, so what is not good in this room? Everything is not smooth guys. As you can see after watching one hour of YouTube video, this room started lagging. Or maybe it's just my phone, comment below and let me know how's your experience with this room. So this room comes with Snapdragon camera but you can always install Gcam and if you don't know how to install Gcam, you can find that video in i button. And now let's talk about most crucial part of any custom room, battery life. I got almost 8 hours of screen on time and 2.5 and days of standby time with this room. So with all that feature, that boot animation and that lag, I'm going to give this room 4.1 out of 5. And the good thing about this room is that it's available for all these phones. Link for that will be in the description box below. And guys if you have any problems, you can always ask me on my Instagram, this is my ID. Now before you go, please like this video, this is your friend Nance signing out and I will see you tomorrow. Ooh.